Hello, Amara. Hey, Shobambras. Hey, Skelophiles. Hey, Amzofanzos. We need to find a good, like, uniform spelling for all those things. Good morning, Amara. It is Friday the 11th. Just kidding, it's actually Wednesday the 9th. So the punishment is tea, mustard, a tablespoon of mustard. It is a lot, Amara. This is my lovely roommate, Gabby, and she's going to film me while I eat mustard. This is Marissa, and she's going to watch me eat mustard. So you didn't specify what kind of mustard to use, so I'm just using this mustard that was in my fridge. It is honey mustard. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is really disgusting, Amara. I hope you enjoy this. Okay. I think that's a whole tablespoon right there. Yeah, that's good. Should I eat it all at once, or just like, lick it? All no, all at once. Can you plug your nose? What? Plug your nose. I should. I'm like, I'm not plucking my nose hairs out, Gabby. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why that would help. Okay, one, two, three. <laughs> I would have far for her. Done. Kind of reminds me of pickles, but in a really terrible way. Update on the mustard sitch. The mustard taste will not go away, even though I've drunk like two cups of milk. <sighs> the only thing to do now is to put peanut butter and jelly on this bagel and eat it. I think the bagel has helped a lot, but I'm still kind of getting that after tasty horribleness. And thus Shelly never ate mustard again. The four minute rule thing is pretty basic and I think it does keep us from like uploading 20 minute rants about Teen Titans, which, you know, I'm pretty sure no one wants to watch. Rule proposal. I think that every month, and we would like switch off, that we should be in charge of getting a guest vlogger to do a vlog on our channel. These vlogs would not replace one of our vlogs, but they would happen in addition to our vlogs. And whoever's month it is, is responsible for that vlogger, and if they don't upload, then like me or you gets punished. Idea, suggestion. We need to have a lot more challenges. I think maybe the challenges could be part of the getting outside our apartments thing. I definitely think that we should have our happy dances in our vlogs. The other day, I received a really positive grade change, and then I did my happy dance for like 30 seconds, but there wasn't anyone to see it. So I say that next time something really, really happy happens to you and you feel like doing your happy dance, record it and put it on the vlog. I don't think this should be a punishable offense, but if I start talking about Teen Titans again, someone should come punch me. I think it'd be cool if we both started doing more musical things. You wanted to go out on location more? Should we have a punishment if our videos are only set in our apartments? Since I want to do more challenges, I challenge you to learn about something you don't know about, and then teach me. Possibly in a silly accent. Probably in a weird place. Viewer question. <laughs> Using your favorite spelling, tell us if you're a Skelophile or an Amzofanzo. I know it's going to be a hard choice because on the one hand, Amor is hilarious, but on the other hand, I have brown hair. Well, Amor, I guess I'll see you on Tuesday.